Inno School is a school created for children who can't afford quality education due to finance, children from low-income families, children who can't afford a square meal a day. NOS creates screen, TVs, computers for us to understand and see what the teacher is teaching us. Living as a 100 day school, uh, we are off-grid. We have 247 electricity in the school. It's a miracle. It's a miracle that we can explain. So we have um, a 20 kilowatt uh, solar energy system that was donated to the North School, costing over 11 million uh, by uh, Azura Energies. I went to training and um, management training, and when I finished my session on my slide, I left a slide about the North School, and I spent about a minute to talk about it. I said, "Hey guys, if anybody here wants to support the kids." or anything you want to do. And this guy walks up to me and says, here's my card, I like what you guys are doing. Uh, let's talk some more. It was a chance meeting with the co-founder of NOSC 100 A Day um, Charity School at the leadership discussion meeting somewhere in Abuja. Uh, one of the things that got to me at the onset was the name. Uh, Azura Power uh, went through a six-year development plan uh, it's uh, at the forefront of a large-scale project financed uh, Greenfield independent power plant. It's a 461 megawatt power plant based in Yehovo village in Benin City. And they call and they ask me, send, do an audit, send an audit. It was about 19 kilowatts of energy to be off-grid. And I asked him, would you guys be able to give all? He laughed, he said, give you all. You know, you know that kind of stuff. And then. After a while, we see an email, congratulations, you're getting solar, the guys are coming for installation. And when the guys came and asked them, they said, you're getting 20 kilowatts of 24 panels, lithium batteries, so not even regular batteries, lithium batteries. The stress of procuring electricity for yourself is overwhelming. So, I'm, so imagine that for a small business like ours. So my heart goes out to big businesses. Businesses that have to be on 247. Poor. Darkness. Traumatic. Is improving. Very appalling. In one word, for me, would be hell on earth. I would say they are just playing with our lives. You know what's the In Nigeria, generally. I will, I will I mean, it is everything, right? I mean, you want to talk about the economic impact, you want to talk about education and healthcare, quality of life generally, and one of the reasons why we suffer in terms of our small businesses, our economy, is because power is, is, is um, not adequately available in Nigeria. Stacking slams is a rebound where they are seeing them as people that are ready to invest in our future because children from low income families like me who don't have to who can't go to schools due to finance. They have provided for us good education. They have provided for us education at a cheaper rate. So, same as my parents, because they have really helped me. I love going to school. Donating this um, solar panel, this help our environment to be well lit, our classrooms to be conducive, and, oh gosh, it is so cool. It's changed our life as a school.